right, guys, we're going to uh, try to catch some bass here on uh, Deep Blue. Here's a little look around there. First place I'm going to try is right over here. If I can get it in the water. There we go. Already got a snag. There we go. Oh, hooked up. Yes. Fish on. Yes. Come to Papa. No, you're not going out there. You're coming in here. No, you're coming in here. Really? Little fighter here. I almost got him in here. There we go. Nice little largemouth bass. I'm using the uh, number three, one third ounce, uh, number three blue jig right there and got that guy. I'll try that same spot again. See if we can get something else out of that hole. Basically, um, I've been doing lift and drop. Twitching works well also. And I've been doing this a lot too, real close like this. Believe it or not, and I've caught fish. Uh, it's kind of funny. Just sitting here one night doing this. When I wasn't filming, of course. And, uh... A fish came along and actually jumped that bait, which was awesome. <clears throat> Let's see if anything hits it. Just out of curiosity. Of course, when I'm filming, it's not going to do it. Alrighty. Alright, we'll try that again later. See if I can catch some more bass here with this blue jig. Mm. I think I cast. Nope, I got it. Sweet. Basically, lift and drop. Uh, just both mouse buttons at the same time. That's what I do. Oh, there we go. There we go. And as you, and my reel speed is on uh, three when I'm doing it. Um, it works the best for me. I don't know if uh, you could try it. It might work good for you. I like it on three most of the time, uh, the reel speed. So, and I've been leaving it because I changed this rod. I should probably put on a stronger rod. It's a little lightweight for these guys, but uh, that's why my drag so low right now. But it's, it's, it's a fun fight most of the time with them, with this rod for sure. I'm not sure what rod it is off the top of my head. And just do some lift and drop again. Ooh, I got three bars on that one. Just lift and drop it all the way over here. See if I get anything. And then I'm going to jig it for a minute, just for the hell of it. I shit you not, I, w I caught fish like this last night. Just reeling it in like that and just doing this. It was hilarious. But of course, when I'm filming, it doesn't want to uh, bite. All right, so that's that jig, which was this one right here. So um, I lost my number four watermelon last night unfortunately i got it hung up on something and it actually broke and i lost it so i'm gonna have to buy me another one so we're gonna switch up to the number two it's the quarter ounce number two uh waterman watermelon color uh jig 
and we'll see what that catches if anything probably take a few casts we're gonna find out oh there we go fish on he's ah, okay got that damn hook to set oh excuse me you hear my reel That <laughs> sounds like it farted. <laughs> it's all real. Hear it? Oh, excuse me. Oh, I'm loving, I'm loving the bass fishing on this particular map. I mean, it's, it's almost better than Missouri, to be honest with you. Missouri's pretty decent, but um. I'm catching way more bass on this on this level than uh oh this is a good fish right here. Yeah, he's just taking line out. I can bump up my drag, but it, if I bump it up and he goes gets me in the red, he's gonna snap the line or get off, so I'm just gonna fight with him and wear him out. We're going to get him. This better be at least a five pounder trophy. I uh, gained some line here. I got 643. I mean, he could take it all the almost 300 feet of line if you wanted to. I'm still going to reel you in, buddy. Up, oh, we're getting closer. He's running. He's running. Come on. No, you're coming in. I almost got him. He must be worn out here. There we go. Nice fish there, I'm sure. Hopefully. Oh, yes. Hell yes. That's a nice uh, trophy bash right there. Awesome. I'm happy I caught that. And I filmed it finally. Alright, we're definitely keeping that one for show. Alrighty, um, they like that watermelon one, that's for damn sure. See if I can pull anything else out from over here. If I don't get anything, I'm going to try to long cast. And I'll show you guys where uh, I usually catch some fish most of the time. I just got to mess with them, see if they're going to bite or not. That'd be hilarious. No. All right. So anyway, I'm going to go as far as I can out that way and let's see what we can, what we can find out here. Do some lift and drop. Turn my reel speed up there so it pops up a lot higher out off the bottom. I usually get some fish out in this area. Don't look like they're liking that lure, though. All right, let's try a long cast off the other way out. Probably by these rocks out there. See if anything's over there anywhere. Usually I get smallmouth on this side by those rocks. Mm. 
Okay, one more cast and I'm switching out the uh, lure. Hopefully I didn't cast on the land. Oh, no, I didn't. Good. Oh, I forgot. This is in a number four. That's why I'm, like, undercasting. Let's try some twitch. I'm going to have to turn down my real speed, though. All right, let's try a different lure. So those were the bass jigs, although you've seen uh, what we could get. Let's try, I want to try, what else do I got? Ah, we could try that. Let's try a jig with the, uh, I think that's a three inch shad, the the yellow and, uh, the yellow and red, red one there. Oh, you have to switch poles, dumbass. I'll twitch this thing in and see if we, uh, I forgot to switch poles. <laughs> <coughs> dumbass. All right. So anyway, hold on. I got to put on a, uh, I want a different lure for that, but uh, there we go. This, actually, I'm going to show you guys this one. I actually caught a fish on it yesterday. Let's see if we can catch a fish while I'm filming. All right, nothing there. I'm going to go a little deeper out there. See if we can get anything to snag that out there. Oh, there's a nice lift and drop right there. The other day, uh, what was it, last night when, when I wasn't filming, I actually caught a, uh, a trophy on this purple lure, uh, the narrow purple, actually. As you can see in the top right hand corner there, for those of you who don't know. Oh, he actually bit it. Hold on, I'm going to let it rest for a second. I wasn't even looking at that. Damn it. They're trying to get it, though. I'm going to let it sit there for a sec. Oh, there we go. Fish on. Narrow purple. Right freaking there. Oh, yeah. Probably, I don't know what it's going to be, though. Let's see what it is. Oh, hell yeah. Smallmouth bass on the narrow purple. What? That's freaking awesome. All right. Let's see if I can get a largemouth over here on a narrow purple just out of curiosity. Let's give it a shot. See what happens. Are we ready? Let's get ready to rumble! It's the rumble in the jungle! <laughs> remember wrestling and the announcers? I remember that back in the day. Oh, I got him, I got him, I got him! Ah! I hate when they do that. He took it, put it in his mouth, but... I pulled back and didn't get a good set. Let's try again. See if I can get one more good fish off of this for you guys. Hold on. I got to turn up my drag. And there, I got it for you. All right. Let's try this again. 
Okay, set the hook this time. Ah, oh, I think I got him. Yes, I got him this time. And is it a large mouth? And it's a large mouth, which is awesome. Off the narrow purple. Wow. All right, I'm going to try some other colors while we're doing this. Uh, let's try, you know what I wanted to try uh, the other day, and I had them at the house. Let's try a slop spoon. A number four slop spoon. And uh, see what that catches. Probably weeds. <laughs> right? Yeah. So anyway, we're going to try this one out. And let it rest there a minute because my arm's itching like crazy. All right, there we go. Oh, get in a bite. Almost had a bite. Did you see that? Crap. Boy, they like that one. I'm gonna. We're gonna have to try that cast again. And jig it for a minute. I shit you not, I'm gonna catch a fish doing that. I did yesterday like three times. All right, let's try this again. Let's see if we can get this fish that bit. Yeah, I cooked them. Sweet. All right. There's a young largemouth off the uh, the one sixth out uh, number four slop spoon, which is pretty cool. My net's full, unfortunately. Um, I'm gonna try a different one for you guys. Hey, let's try the trout spinner. I'm going to try one of the trout spinners and uh, see what we can come up with with a trout spinner real quick. Hopefully I don't go on the ground. Ah, uh, I made it. Alright, I'm just going to kind of twitch it a little bit. And then I'm going to let it drop. Let it sit. I'm going to do some lift and drop real quick. I like to mix it up a little bit. You know, do some twitching, do some lift and drop, even though when you're doing lift and drop, it says you're twitching, but, all right, let's try the trout lure this side real quick and see if we can get anything. Do some lift and drop. Let it drop, lift it up again. Sometimes I don't let it drop all the way. Ah, just my little, you know. I'm gonna do some twitching. I like sometimes if you, uh, when you're bringing it in and you just bring it on in the, on the top water, the fish will grab that damn thing and jump out of the water and just be on, bam, and he's on, you know, it's like, wow. Let's see, I want it by that rock over there. Ah, there we go. There we go. All right, let's see if we don't catch anything on this one. I'm gonna bring them in and we'll, we'll change And try a different lure. See what else we can. I just want to show you guys. I mean, oh, do I still got my pike lure? That one is awesome. Or was awesome for me. Do some stop and go. All right. Not so much like in that one, apparently. So, what else do I want to try? But I have caught them on the spinners, Noble. 
We know the narrow work. The purple one worked especially good. Let's try this one. They love in Missouri, and I've caught a buttload of fish here with it also. So let's try it again. If I can get it to cast and hit water instead of land. All right, here we go. And of course, I, I don't want to lose my lure. I like that one. Okay. See what I mean? They like that one. He grabbed it. He just didn't hit it hard enough to take it. Try that again. Just Oh, did you see that? They almost bit it. I almost jigged that fish. No bull. I told you they'll do it. Let's see if I can get him to come back. Probably not. Alright, he's not coming. So anyway. Right. Oh, I cast it too far. I wish the bars would stay on here so you could see. That's too far, I bet. Oh, no, perfect. If the bars would stay there, you could gauge where you're casting a lot better. That's for damn sure. Oh, yeah, fish. Oh, fish on. Yeah, yeah, bite. Hold on, I got to get the hook set. It's not set yet. See how it's still gold down there? Ah, there we go. I got a nice set on them now. There we go. Come on, you're coming in. Try to get them in here a little quicker. There we go. Almost. And landed them. That's a nice fish too. Boy, they really like that lure. Woo! 16, finally. Jesus. Yes! Got 33 gold off that too. Awesome. And I cast a 2-4 yet again. All right. Let's see what else we can get. Oh, let's do a far cast off to the left uh, with this lure. I bet you I'll get a hit then. Most likely. I know the bass jigs, some of the bass jigs work uh, out there where I long casted the last time. Oh, I got to jig it. I, I so want to catch one of these when I'm filming. Like right here, that'd be so sick. But of course, all I got was that weird little nibble and he swam off. Okay, not happening. I also caught a fish right over here the other day. I think I'm going to try it out. Wow, there we go. Come on. Do some lift and drop. I'm going to try stop and go this time. If I can get it down. I've been... That semi got it down. Usually I get three bars, but not today, of course. Kind of bass there at that tree, too, before. I'm going to cast right out. See that tree right out there in the water? Go as far as I can, and we're going to see if we can get anything on the hook. Whew, that's pretty far. 
Here, I'm gonna I'm gonna ramp it up to four. I can get some better stop and go action that way. I do believe. It's like too fast. It won't register on the on the thing right there. All right, let's uh, switch it up to some lift and drop. See if anything likes that instead of uh, maybe it didn't like stop and go. Oh, there we go, fish on. Holy smokes, he's way out there too. Hopefully, I can get him in. I almost got him in here. Oh, yes. Ah, nice small mouth out that way, too. See what I mean, guys? Like, I thought small mouth bass were more to the right, but they're not. They're left also, so... That, I mean, that proved it right there. There's fish all over the place here. Let's, uh... See that rock out there where I, this is dangling? Let's try right out there. I don't think I've tried out there before, and I think I'm gonna hit the rock. Well, got it in the water, apparently. Try some twitch. Really, to do a good twitch, you need to... Have it lower, you know, like that. There we go. Now I got a good twitch going. I'm going to twitch it in and see what we can come up with here. Alright. I think I'm going to let it sink down and do some lift and drop and, uh, See if that produces anything by the time I get it in. And that's a no. Alright, so. We tried those lures. I want to try this lure next. And then I want to try one of these casting spoons. I haven't used the casting spoon on this level yet. So let's try on this side of the rock. Just out of... Who knows? Maybe there's a fish there. Right? No, nope, don't look like there's going to be a fish there. <laughs> oh, maybe. Hold on. Oh, I almost had a fish. Yes, of course I get it hung up. Oh, I got it out. I'm lifting and dropping and it says twitching half the time. That's crazy. Oh, got him. See how close that one was? Yes. Well, they like the red and uh, chrome one too, apparently. I 
Let's see if we can uh, get one more fish here for you guys and I'll wrap this uh, bass fishing lure video up. Alright, I'm going to go right there. And I cast it too far. There we go. Man, I like when you cast it. It like sinks. And you and the and the fish is just on it like that sometimes. Fish on. Holy crap, I'm gonna lose him. Oh no, I didn't. Sweet. Alright guys, and that's uh, bass fishing with the lure in North Carolina. I hope this helps you out. And just experiment with different stuff like I do. Um, I didn't even use the jig, did I? Or the shad. Those shads work too great for catching these things. So experiment and uh, leave comments and let me know how you like the vids. And uh, you guys have a good one. Tight lines all. I'm out. Hola totres, soy el Borichochos. Today os voy a explain how to do a tutorial about how to compression. Ah, me habéis notado ahí un poco la voz eh, hecha, hecha un poco añicos. Eh, sí, estoy constipado. No es la droga. Eh, eh, perdón, que se me cae la coquita. Eh, bueno, per perdón, perdonadme, pero es que estoy un poco, estoy constipado, entonces por eso tengo esta voz. Así que bueno, eh, hice una encuesta por Twitter, la estaréis viendo en pantalla.